what's up everybody welcome back to the channel and welcome to a, another video so i thought i would talk you through my morning skincare routine for an over 40s skin if you're new here hey my name is vilma i'm 43 years old and my skin type is combination to oily i have also dehydrated skin enlarged pores and my skin is sometimes prone to breakouts like for example right now i have a few breakouts right here and this is all to do with eating chocolate i eat a little bit too much i always always get a few breakouts especially here on my jaw area but for the most part my skin is pretty clear the entire year i only get a pimple here and there so i'm going to share my steps my routine in the morning from cleansing to moisturizing i think it's really important to find the right routine for you for your skin type it really makes a whole difference if you find the right products because your skin is just going to look so much better when it's naked or when you want to wear makeup as well the products that you're going to see in this video are a combination of a drugstore and high-end and kind of like a middle range I feel like skincare is just skincare there are really good products at the drugstore store and I tend to go to the drugstore for facial cleansers, toners, sometimes even moisturizers. I tend to go to the drugstore. There's some staple here that I'm going to show you guys that I've been using for quite some time and I absolutely love them and I've repurchased them and repurchased them over and over again. So I will be touching on those and why I love them so much. So the first step of my day is to use a cleanser and the one that I absolutely love is this one by Boots. So Boots is a drugstore here in the UK and they have their own skincare line and even makeup line within their store. And I really love this vitamin C. I'm thinking about trying other things from this line but at this present moment this is the only one that I actually have. It's great. It's supposed to brighten the skin within 14 days and I feel like my skin has been looking a lot brighter since I started using Using it and this just comes to show that buying something affordable with good ingredients can definitely do the job and it's quite comparable to higher-end products I use this every morning before I go out or if I take a shower in the morning right after my workout this is the cleanser that I reach for although I have three in my bathroom but I really really love this super inexpensive I think it costs around six pounds and it does wonders to my skin so after my cleanser I go on to toner and this one is also by Boots. This one is called the Sensitive Refreshing Toner with Soothing Aloe Vera and this is supposed to remove impurities or if you're using it at night it's supposed to remove any left up residues from your makeup. So I use it on a cotton pad just like this and I tend to just swirl it around a little bit. Some people do it upwards motions. I don't see any difference when I do that and I feel like just doing this really does the job. It's super refreshing and it really helps to minimize the size of my pores. And although I cleanse my skin, I still see a little bit of impurities on the pad. So it's definitely worth having a toner. So whilst my toner is kind of like setting, I really like to leave it for about a minute or two. I go ahead and I moisturize my lips and I use my Vaseline lip balm. I have so many everywhere around my house in each bag that I have. This is super moisturizing and it's something that I reach for all the time. I have it in my vanity ready for me to use every single morning. So my next step is going to be a serum and the one that I'm using is this one by Holland and Barrett. It's a vitamin C plus hyaluronic acid. I've been using this now for two months and I've definitely noticed a huge difference on my skin. I use it day and night and I really like it. It's not expensive. I think it cost me around 15 pounds and Holland and Barrett does so many promotions where they just do buy one get one for a penny it's like the penny sale so I have a second bottle of this in my bathroom and I really really love it so I only get like a drop out of that and then I just press it into the skin I used to rub my serums and now I just press them into the skin and I love the way this one feels because it doesn't 
leave a tacky feeling. It just absorbs so, so nicely. So whilst the serum is sinking in, I'm gonna move on to my eye cream. This one is the Hydrating Eye Cream by Bobbi Brown, which looks like this. This is one of my staples. I've been repurchasing this all the time. I buy it at least once or twice a year, and it's one of the best eye creams I have ever used. It's super hydrating. Do you know that feeling when you cleanse your skin and you don't apply anything and you have that tight feeling around your eye area? This will completely abolish that because it hydrates the eye so nicely. And the best part of it is if you wear makeup, this eye cream also has a primer that will help your concealer stay in place so much better and not emphasize fine lines. My next step will be SPF. And I find this such an important step. I say it every time I do makeup videos or I talk about skincare, SPF is very, very important. The one that I'm using is this one by Simple. Again, another drugstore product. This is called the Radiance Booster with SPF 30 and it's part of the Protect and Glow line. Now it looks like it's an oil and at first I was really concerned. I wasn't sure if this was going to make my skin feel and look greasy, but it doesn't do that at all. What I tend to do is allow three drops to just fall on my hand and then I rub it all over my skin and I promise you this product does not leave your skin feeling greasy at all. It's really nice. It leaves a really nice glow to the skin, especially if you have dull skin. This will leave your skin looking very nice and glowy. And the rest of the product, I tend to just rub it all over my hands. It doesn't harm anything if you apply a little bit of SPF there. And my last step of my skincare routine is a moisturizer, and this is the Vitamin Enriched Face Base by Bobbi Brown. I've been, again, repurchasing this product every year because I love it so much. It looks like this. It smells amazing. And again, because it's a moisturizer from Bobbi Brown, of course, it's not just only a moisturizer, it's also a primer. So I tend to apply a really small amount. It's super moisturizing and so refreshing on the skin. Any other product that you will apply on top, as in tinted moisturizer, foundation, BB cream, it's just going to go so smoothly and you don't need to apply an extra layer of primer because this one already has one. So that is my everyday morning skincare routine for a lovely moisturized and glowy skin for over 40s. I do hope that you guys enjoyed this video and if you did please make sure to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and give this video a good thumbs up. It would mean the world to me and it also helps my channel grow. Thank you so much for joining me and I'll see you on my next video. Bye!